One of my favorite movies in recent years has been The King's Speech. It's the story, the most unlikely story, of a friendship between the future King of England, George VI, and a little-known speech therapist from Perth, Western Australia, by the name of, name of Lionel Logue. And as the film develops, you begin to understand that the king is, is, is entrusting his speech impediment to a man who has no qualifications. And yet Logue succeeds where no one else can, because he has something that qualification can't give you. He has the power of innovation. And in the age of the RFID, the radio frequency ID tag, it is no longer the size of your knowledge database that brings you influence. A radio frequency ID tag is a device as small as a grain of sand, and yet it is large enough to contain a battery, a receiver, a transmitter, and storage space. We can take all of your healthcare information, ladies and gentlemen, and put it on that little tiny device. If we can take such a huge body of information and put it on something so small, it is not any longer an impressive thing to know a lot. What is impressive now is to be able to innovate with your information, to add value to it in some way that improves human life or the human environment. 